As we drop down onto the reef for my last dive in Pulaway, we find ourselves amongst this school of bicolor parrotfish. And they were feeding like crazy across the top of the reef there. First interesting critter I found was this guy. He's called a leaf scorpion fish. Uh, many people think it's a frogfish when they first see it because of the, uh, the small pectoral fins there. This is a peacock flounder. I didn't get to film him for very long. Very well camouflaged. These Clark's anemone fish are very common on all of the reefs in the tropics, but the kind of anemone that they're hiding in is very unusual. These are called yellow fin surgeon fish. Uh, we don't see these very often in Thailand. There's a large school of them in the sand at around about 20 meters. And this is a cool's ray. Many people confuse the cool's ray with a blue spot stingray. Uh, but the cool's ray has a more elongated body and a much longer tail. And if you look closely, they also have a black ring around the blue dots on their body. The mouth is on the underside of the body and he's actually feeding now. They feed on small mollusks, crabs, any kind of shells. They have grinding teeth. Now I would never have found this guy without the help of my Indonesian guide. That there is the most venomous fish in the world. That is a stonefish. And many people confuse scorpion fish with stonefish, but if you see them together, there's no confusion. That's another kind of stonefish right there. Very well camouflaged. You can just make out the eye in the center of the screen. And the dorsal spines are down at the moment, but it's the dorsal spines along the top of the body that have all the venom. This is a rare and unusual kind of moray. He's called a snowflake moray. And I actually filmed him just in the sand in front of the dive resort. It just goes to show you don't need to be on a reef to find interesting critters. Tucked in behind the moray there, I'm focused on the white line cleaner shrimp. You can see he's about to start picking parasites off the moray. And once the moray leaves, these little basslets also came in for a clean. This is another example of a cool's ray. You can see there just how long his tail is. If that was a blue spot ray, he would have a much shorter tail and a more rounded body. This is a classic example of a butterfly fish. He's called a long-nosed butterfly fish. He's got a big false eye on his tail, which is very common with many kinds of species of butterfly fish. And this guy is a common lionfish, aptly named, the most common lionfish you'll find on any tropical reef. It's called Pulaway. It's on the north coast of Sumatra. It's a fantastic dive site. You get there from Jakarta or Kuala Lumpur.